Today we're going to answer a user question I have received in the comments. So let me just quickly show the question to you. This is the question that you see here on the screen. We're talking about a replacement of a username with a real name and we'll dive into that in a moment. And I also show you my solution. I would approach this with two star replacer nodes. So I received this comment here under my rule engine dictionary video. I'm a complete beginner in NIME and need help. I want to replace certain cells by a rule or another node. I have this table A where I have, for example, in column A, XX441 as a username and in the second column XX339 as a username. And then there's table B, which I would interpret as a user table. And there we have the usernames in the first column and the real names of Fritz and Rachel in the second column. I want to replace the username in table A with the real name from table B. So that in table A instead of XX441 should be Fritz in the table. All right, so let me just share my nine workflow with you. I basically first recreated those two tables using NIME's table creator node. And here we have the approval level one, where we have XX41 in the first row, then two names. And here is approval level two, where we have one of those usernames in the second row. All right, we didn't change anything, so we can close that. And the second table is basically kind of a dictionary where we have all the usernames, in this case only two, in the first column, and all the real names in the second column. I would use the cell replacer here. Basically what we do with the cell replacer, we replace one value with another, which from my understanding is exactly what the user wanted to do here. So double click cell replacer, which is the target column where the replacement should take place. And that is actually for the first one, it's the approval level or Freigabestufe one. Then we have the lookup value in the dictionary table, that is the username. So basically from here, from the target column, we use the values and then we look each row's value up here in the lookup column and we replace it with the name. And we want to have an exact match. We don't want to have a fuzzy match because one username equals one real name. And then, very important for the cell replacer, what should we do if we don't have a match? Then we just want to keep what we have at the input here. And if you look at this, we have not made any changes here. If we just look at the output table, you see now XX441 has been replaced with Fritz. As the cell replacer goes through these columns one by one, we need to chain a second one in here where we basically do exactly the same only for the second target column. I know that with column expressions, for example, and some if and else conditions that would have been probably even a smaller workflow, but I wanted to make it as low code or as no code as possible. So if you have any questions to me, Make sure you post them in the comments down below. I also link to the original video up here. And by the way, at the time of this recording, we are approaching the Spring Summit. And I will be speaking at the NIME Spring Summit in Berlin in less than a week. So if you happen to be there at the NIME Spring Summit, make sure you step by and say hello. Until then, take care and bye-bye.